this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video, and another challenge against I Ballistic Squid. And uh, this is a this is a very weird challenge. This one is called the Mirror Challenge, and right now I am controlling Minecraft while looking into a mirror. So I've basically turned my uh, monitor around so I can't see it, and I've then put a mirror behind the monitor. So I'm looking past the monitor into the mirror and seeing the screen that way. So basically everything is completely uh, flipped. And what that means is that if I push in one direction, if I push left, I look right. And then if I look right, I look left. And then if I look, uh, if I move to the side, I move in the opposite direction that I push to. And so rather than seeing Minecraft like this, I am seeing it like this. So it all looks normal enough. But just controlling this is just really difficult. And it probably doesn't sound difficult, but trust me, it really is. If you want to go into <laughs> uh, test controlling Minecraft like this for yourself, uh, using a, a mirror, uh, you'll see just how difficult uh, it is to, to do absolutely anything. And uh, also all the uh, the writing, as you can see there, is all going to be uh, completely backwards uh, as well. Uh, but yeah, this is what the, uh, the challenge is. If I can get through the door, there we go. You can see this is my room and it's uh, a mirror. You can see this glass here is basically acting like uh, a mirror and I need to make it. Uh, so that the reflection is exactly the same uh, as the uh, the room I'm in now. And uh, it's almost exactly the same, uh, apart from, uh, if you look in the, the background there, uh, there's a lime green piece of wall, a mushroom in a plant pot, and a, uh, a bookcase, which is not on this side over here, which means, uh, you probably guessed it, I need to go and try and get a, uh, a piece of lime wall, I need to get, and get a, a mushroom, and uh, I also need to get a bookcase, and then if I put them down there in a row so it looks exactly the, the, the same, uh, then I am going to, to be the, the winner. Uh, so that is what my challenge is gonna, uh, going to be. So it's all quite easy easy what I need to do the only difficulty is that I need to do it while controlling the game like this and uh, yeah I can't begin to explain how difficult it is to control like this <laughs> the only thing I can do is go try it for yourself for just a second and uh, your experience uh, how hard this is right uh, I do have a um a few items uh, to make things easier <laughs> even grabbing these items is difficult uh, you can see I got some cooked fish sandwiches here uh, we got some tools as well and this is so hard I can't even grab this stuff <laughs> uh, yes yeah, so I got all of these things here I got some tools I got my stampy style boots uh, as well and uh, yeah so I'm not completely helpless as uh, something else which is difficult is that the um the mirror uh, to be able to fit the screen in is quite far away so not only am I seeing things reversed I'm looking at a, a reflection of a screen which is a uh, quite far away so I'm looking at like a tiny little um uh, like a little display which is reversed so I can't move and I can hardly see it anyway so <laughs> uh, who knows how well uh, this is uh, going to, to go and so the way we're going to do the challenge is that uh, we're both going to, to go to, to bed and then once we've slept in the, the morning uh, it's basically going to be as soon as it's daytime uh, we're ready to, to begin the, the challenge and then the first one just to put all the, the items down uh, is going to, to be the, the, the winner so uh, it should be uh, night time now uh, let me go and uh, look on the, the bed and wait in bed and uh, yeah then as soon as uh, Squid Nugget goes to, to sleep as well we're going to, to begin the, the mirror challenge uh, so I guess while I'm waiting for him to go to bed, I can start planning. What shall I go for first? They're all relatively easy. I think the hardest one uh, might be the um, uh, the lime green wall. Uh, just to, to get the, the lime green, I need to, to cook a cactus, and then I also need uh, to get bone meal. And I think getting bone meal uh, might be tough, because I don't know <laughs> uh, how good of a, a job I'm going to do fighting uh, googlies uh, yeah, when, um, yeah, when I can hardly control the game. But we'll give it a go. The first thing I can see, though, is that over here, uh, we have some sugar cane. And I do need sugar cane. Oh, no, there's something Something burning over there. As I said, my screen's really small. I think that was a skeleton. Was that a skeleton? If that was... Oh no, what am I doing? I can't. I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> right, let's go and break this sugar cane. I can grab this. And yeah, I saw a skeleton bur uh, burning. If he dropped a bone and I got bone mill this early on, that would be very handy. Oh look, there we go. I do. I got bone mill. That uh, was probably uh, going to be one of the, the toughest things. So I'm glad I, I got that. And there's a sheep over here. As if I take out the uh, the sheep, uh, then that way I'll be able to get some wool as well. There's no point uh, trying to, to make shears as soon as I only need one piece. Uh, piece of wool. So I am going to have uh, to be a little bit mean here <laughs> and uh, take out the, the sheep. Uh, but it's what I, I need to do for the, the challenge if I can actually do it. There we go. So I got the, the wool. Uh, so now I need the, uh, I need cactus. I need uh, to go and get the, the cactus. And I did see uh, a desert nearby. Uh, so that should be easy. And uh, the mushrooms as well might be a little bit difficult. Uh, so there is a, a swamp here. Uh, so while I'm uh, swinging past, oh, actually... I need a leather. The bookcase might actually be the hardest thing, because I need uh, quite a lot of leather, and uh, then I need uh, to make the uh, the books. So I got the, the sugar cane to make the paper for the books, and then you need uh, quite a lot of leather as well. And where did that 
Oh, so <laughs> I knocked the, the cow underwater for ages there. There we go. It did drop a little bit of leather. I think I grabbed it. It's kind of hard to see. Let me try and get out of this water and see if I did grab the, the leather. Yes, I did. There we go. So there's one piece of leather. Uh, so yeah, whenever I see a cow, uh, I need to go out my way uh, to try and take it out. But as I said, uh, I'm going to go now and try and get the, um, uh, the, the mushrooms. And here we go. There's a mushroom right about here, I think. Yep, I can go and grab myself one of these. <laughs> well, try to anyway. I think I got it. Let's go and get a, another one just for safety. And there is another cow right here here if I can try and no, I, can't, I can't do this moving and turning you can kind of get a bit used to but if you go and try and step to the side that's reversed as well so like you're turning and that's like flipped and then moving to the side is flipped as well it just makes this whole thing very very complicated but I think I actually got a, yeah, a really good start there getting that bone uh, was very very lucky and that should hopefully uh, put me in the uh, the advantage uh, against squid nugget all right, so uh, next stop is uh, to the uh, the desert, I think, and I'm gonna go and try and get the uh, the cactus, and then uh, once I've uh, uh, put that in the furnace, I will have everything I need to make the lime green wool. Uh, so then I probably need to get a, a few more pieces of sugar cane, maybe. And oh, oh, there's a village over there, I think, or a temple or something, maybe. Oh, I think there's a temple over there. Yeah. So then I've got everything for the um, yeah the lime green wool, and then for the the bookcase, I just need a, a bunch more sugar cane and a lever, I think, and then oh, a bit of wood as well. I need to go and cut down a, a tree at some point, and then the only other thing is the um uh, the plant pot and i need oh is that is this clay here it's kind of hard to, to see. Let me go and break this away. I think this might be some some clay right here. Let me go and have a look. Did I get clay or is that just sand? Oh no, that's just sand there. Um, no, this is all just sand. Oh, actually, that's clay there though. I can never tell if it's clay or sand. Oh, look, there's another cow ahead of me as well. Right, I'm going to go and uh, get that cow because I do need uh, as much leather as I can get. But first, uh, let's go and get all this clay and then I can go and make the, the plant pot. I must say, I am absolutely blazing through this. And uh, I do actually really want to beat Squid uh, because he pretty much always beats me. Me with these challenges. I, I win one every now and then when he does really bad, but generally uh, he seems to be better than me. So I, I feel like I've got something to, to prove. So I want to thank you <laughs> for watching my view rather than his, uh, unless you've come from his and then gone to uh, gone to mine. Because uh, yeah, that's the good thing about these challenges is that we both upload our views. So you can kind of see uh, what I'm doing now. Uh, but yeah, I have no idea what Squid's doing, uh, but you can just go and check out his view uh, if you're curious to see what he's doing or even watch them side by side. It could be quite fun. <laughs> and then just sort of switch between whose commentary you list to listen to. And uh, we are allowed to eat this cake here, uh, but the, um, the cake in the the middle we can't eat because if I ate this cake, then that way it wouldn't be uh, symmetrical to the, the other side, would it? <laughs> right, I've got the, the furnace here. And oh, I need some fuel, actually. I do need some uh, some fuel. So yeah, I should probably go now and uh, try and uh, cut down a tree uh, so I can get the, the wood for the, the bookcase, uh, as well as uh, some wood uh, that I can just go and put in the, the furnace. So there's a tree right here. Uh, this should do just about handily. Uh, so let me go and try and cut this down. Looking up and down, isn't like difficult because it's the same as it normally is but because everything else is flipped you kind of expect it to be flipped so the fact that it's not flipped kind of actually makes it a little bit harder and oh was that some more random wood around here i uh, don't mind if i do i'll go and grab this and uh, yeah now back to the the house i don't think i've seen squid once yet unless he's been in the the background and i haven't noticed i think he might have he's gone for quite a, a big explore i wonder what he's looking for anyway uh, let's go and uh, make all of this wood into planks because i don't need any of it to not be planks and then i can just go and put a, a little bit of it in here as fuel and uh, let's see what I can I can make then. So that's going to be to make the the die. Oh yeah, I can also after this has been finished, I can go and uh, put the um uh, the clay in as well, uh, so I can get some bricks to to make the the plant pot. Uh, so I guess uh, while that's going, I can have uh, another quick sweep for any cows just to see if there are any close by. And I don't seem to to be able to to see any. Maybe that's what Squid's done. Uh, he's gone wandering off uh, cow hunting. Maybe that's what he's doing. All uh, right then, I got myself my green die. I can go and grab that, and I can go and put my clay in, which is whoop down about here. <laughs> right, let's go and do my, my wall then. I think I've got everything I need. So I can go and make myself some... Uh, I think if I make green dye first... Oh, no, I already have green dye, don't I? Uh, so if I need to make the, the bones uh, into to bone meal. And I should have just done that from that same menu, shouldn't I? Even the menus are difficult. <laughs> Even the menus are hard to control. There we go. Lime green dye. Exactly what I, what I needed. And then I've got my uh, wall on me anyway. So uh, now I just need to go and uh, die them. Does that say wall? Yep, I think this does. Uh, there we go. I've done it. One thing is down already. So I want to make sure I place it in the, the right place because yeah, it needs to be uh, an exact mirror. Uh, first, I need to get through these menus. <laughs> and if I turn around and there we go, the lime green uh, block of wall is down already. So hopefully uh, this clay should be finished as well. Yeah, we go. I only need three bricks. Uh, so now I can try and navigate my world to this uh, crafting table. I can go and make myself the, the plant pot. And uh, I think it's here yet yeah, in decorations. I can now 
go put my mushroom down. And then the last thing I need is the, the bookcase, which, uh, yeah, I think might be the, the hardest one. I'm going to see exactly uh, how much paper and uh, how much leather I need. Uh, then I know what I need uh, to go and hunt for. It's also going to become night soon. And uh, Squid Nugget probably isn't going to, to want to sleep because uh, I reckon he's going to be still going after after a bone is what I guess. Uh, right then. Uh, so that's there. Uh, there we go. That's two done. Uh, perfectly in place. The last thing is the, the bookcase. So that's going to be in a decorations as well. Uh, I think it's in decorations, isn't it? Is it down here somewhere? Uh, there we go. Here's the bookcase. So I need three books. And to make a book, I need three pieces of leather. And uh, uh, no, uh, yeah, three pieces of leather, one per book. And then I need nine pieces of paper. So let's see uh, how much paper I can make first, shall we? Uh, so I was able to make... Uh, I've, only got, uh, I've only got three pieces of paper. So I need to get uh, some more sugar cane. And then I need to get, uh, I think, one more. Uh, oh no, I've got enough leather already. All it is I, I need now is, uh, is sugar cane. And uh, so how much sugar cane goes to make one uh, piece of paper then? Uh, so it's three. It's three. So I need uh, three, four more uh, pieces of, uh, of sugar cane. And then I have everything that I that I need. Although, seeing as I am going up against Squid Nugget, what I should do, uh, just to be mean, <laughs> is if I see a cow, I should go and take the, the lever anyway, uh, because then that way it's going to be stopping him from getting it. <laughs> I know it's a bit of a, a mean tactic, but it's, it's the aim of the game. We are against each other. And as I said, I do really want to, to win this time. So uh, let's go and have a little bit of a look around here and uh, see if I can find some sugar cane. Like I could plant some and uh, leave it to, to grow but I'm just worried that squid would uh, see it and uh, and steal it so I'm just hoping uh, that I'm gonna go and get lucky and uh, try and find some uh, that does though uh, seem to be the the edge of the world in that direction if I go and grab my map uh, mainly so I don't get lost but also to find where the the water is yeah I'm right down on the the edge of the world here let's go in this direction and uh, look along here that seems to be uh, where most of the the water is <laughs> and navigating with this map is very difficult yes yeah, so I kind of want to head around this direction and uh, keep an eye out uh, for any uh, around here and uh, just be careful for when it becomes night uh, that I do not get taken out. And oh look, there is another cow up here, right? I'm going to do what I said. <laughs> Let's go take out the, the cow and steal the, the lever uh, just to try and slow down Squid's progress uh, a little bit. Let's go and try and get it. Oh, it's running away from me. It's running away from me. It can actually control better than me for once, right? Oh no, it's still getting away. It's a slippery little cow, this one. Oh look, there's another one down here as well. Uh, let's go and try and uh, get this one as well. Oh no, I knocked it back into the, the water. Knocking lots of cows into the, the water so far here, aren't I? Oh, where's it gone? Did I get it? Yep, I think I was uh, able to, to get it right then uh, still on the the hunt for for sugar cane then uh, let's just go and follow around the the water it's probably going to be the easiest way to do this I am getting a little bit peckish as well though so I should probably go and uh, eat some of these these fish and I really don't need that much more to be honest it's just that there's only you know a certain amount of sugar cane you get in each world and a uh, squid seems to have been uh, exploring for for quite a while uh, so I'm just worried that he would have got uh, all of the the sugar cane uh, which is a uh, close by so I do have a, a large resort of uh, trying to, to grow the, the sugar cane that I already have. Uh, but that would be just quite slow. It would be much easier if I can go and find some my uh, myself. I don't know, though, if you get sugar cane in swamps. This area here, uh, there's a whole load of water, which is handy. Uh, but it's all in a, a swamp. And uh, I don't actually know whether you get sugar cane in swamps. I think I think you might do, but I'm not entirely... Oop! That was a hole. That was a hole I just fell down. <laughs> and now I can't get out of it either. Because I keep walking in the wrong direction. And oh no, it's happened. It has become dark. It is night time now. And I'm stuck in a hole. See, if I have to go up against some googlies. And I'm struggling uh, around the place like that. Uh, then it's going to be very difficult. I keep getting tricked by all of these vines though. I keep thinking... Uh, that all of these uh, these vines are um, are sugar cane, but they're not. They just kind of look a little bit similar when you're uh, far away from them. Hmm, I'm not getting very lucky here. I think I might have to go and uh, try and plant my my sugar cane. I just don't want Squid just to come in and steal it because then I'm going to be further down. No, no, I'm not. I'm, I'm going to not do that. I'm going to wander around uh, for a little bit longer first. I do, though, uh, have those uh, torches uh, so I can kind of place these uh, around uh, a little bit uh, just so I can see what I'm doing. And uh, let's just try and get make my way uh, out of this swamp then. I want to kind of uh, stick to, to where the, the water is uh, but try and uh, make my way uh, out of the, uh, the swamp because uh, there doesn't seem to be any uh, inside of this area. I think you do get them in deserts because they kind of always grow on sand, don't they? So I guess it would kind of makes sense uh, to see them in deserts and aha look there's some right here oh look there's loads this is all that i need this is all the sugar cane that I need. If I go and get this and uh, bring it back, uh, then I'm going to have everything that I need uh, in order to win. So really, all I need to do now is make sure I get home safely, uh, which uh, might be harder than it sounds. <laughs> and uh, also, I uh, hope that Squid hasn't done better than me. I reckon the main thing that he needs uh, is going to, to be the bone, because uh, that's probably the uh, the hardest thing. And I did get very lucky uh, finding my bone. So if I just go and charge back straight away, I'm going to very quickly check that Squid hasn't won, uh, seen as uh, normally <laughs> he does. And uh, yeah, then I can go and try and make the, the final thing and uh, be the winner. 
there. Right, let's go, 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 go. If I'm really fast, uh, hopefully I'm going to get there before there's uh, too many googlies around. I do not want my house to get blown up because, yeah, then it will not look very symmetrical. <laughs> Unless I get two, two creepers to blow it up. Like, if one side gets blown up, I guess if I just destroy the other side in the, the exact same way, <laughs> I guess it would still be uh, still be okay. Where is Squid, though? I've not seen him in ages. He must be uh, out exploring the place somewhere. I wonder what he's looking for. Let's go and see uh, what progress he, uh, he has had. Oh, I don't think... Yeah, he hasn't got anything put down yet. He has not been able uh, to place anything down. So now, uh, what I need to do is I uh, go and make the, the final bookcase. I'm going to make it quick anyway, in case he charges back and uh, is able to do it. All right, let's go and make uh, all of the, the paper. Then I can go and make my books. I've got a spare one as well. And uh, I've got the, the wooden planks as well. I think I should have everything that I need. Let's go and switch through. There we go. There's the bookcase. I can click on it. And now all I need to do is go and place it down right about there. There we go. My room now is uh, perfectly symmetrical. <laughs> Look at this. It's the, the mirror image. I got the, the lime green wall. I got the, the mushroom in the plant pot. And I got the bookcase, which means Stampy Cat was the winner. Yay! <laughs> oh, this was a really fun and very difficult challenge uh, to, to do. Uh, but hopefully you uh, enjoyed me uh, struggling through this and uh, solving uh, all of the uh, the challenges and uh, being able to, to win. As I mentioned earlier, there'll be a link in the description to Squid's channel if you want to go and check out his view of the, the mirror challenge. And uh, yeah, if you want to record yourself doing it uh, yourself, I'd uh, love to, to see those videos just send them to me on twitter or facebook or youtube or, or wherever and i'll see as many as i can uh, but sadly uh, we have just about uh, run out of time in this video now uh, so yeah i want to thank you all very much for watching and i will see you all later bye